I need to buy a new shirt for tonight. So we'll have a look what we can find in here. Hi, welcome along to today's vlog. Today is a vlog that might not see the light of day. It will, I'm sure. I'm going to be generous enough. I've got an awards dinner tonight for the Cambridge Digital Awards and I'm nominated for an award for the Cambridge Saxophone website, which is really humbling. Some more emails popping in. Today's supposed to be my day off. Um, as you've seen in earlier footage, I had to nip into Cambridge. I had a coffee with someone, tried out the new MacBook Pro, with the touch bar which is really good but it's kind of weird how often when you're with the touch bar you want to touch the screen so I was just working away in Final Cut Pro and you move them and then you want to touch the screen to do something and so I don't know maybe Apple need to think about that one they're normally pretty good with people's feedback and weirdly there was no kind of uh, touch bar whatever they're calling it for um, Logic what there was for GarageBand which is a bit stupid in my mind having watched this uh, masterclass by Chris Potter in Barcelona, I have just been inspired to get get my overtones done today and to work on a voicing on it. And I'm just going to show you this kind of idea on voicing. It's dead easy. So say you've got a D minor chord. You might make that into a D minor 11 by putting a, a D minor chord with a C major triad. Um, you can voice that a different way, it doesn't have to be. You can be. I'm also getting really onto this Charlie Parker tune segment, which um, I heard Luca playing last week. It's a fantastic piece. I'm just doing the edit now and uh, this is a close-up of the award I'm holding. I'm just realising that as good a job as Katie did at the back, sadly because it's on the iPhone, the zoom just isn't big enough. I was at the back and kind of thought there's no way I'm going to win, they don't put the winners at the back of these events, but <laughs> they did. I just want to say one last thing before I finish. What made it for me was the fact that what the judges said about customer testimonials and I think if any of you are in business or wanting to be musicians, music teachers, everything like that, 
your customers your students are your best selling point and I'm so grateful for my students I'm so grateful for the work they put it in for the enthusiasm they show for the passion they share with me and for the willingness to engage in my passion for music so this award is just as much theirs as it is mine because it's a story of shared passion and um, I'm going to treasure this, it's going to go back up on the wall in a minute, um, but it means a lot because of what the judges said about how my, how my customers, my students engage with the website. So thank you so much to every single one of you who voted to nominate me and the judges, but most of all to my students because you're the guys that make this happen. So, and if you are in business and things like that, you know, work with your customers, work with your, uh, your core base and if they say good things about you, you'll always w win new customers and maybe even awards as well. Caught beneath a landslide In a champagne supernova Champagne supernova